calculation that doesn't vanish will get longer. Fusion projection says that if the fusion. Right, now let's take a photo together. We often call them geniuses. Establish himself. Or madmen. Sometimes their compositions are difficult for us to understand. The mathematics is very beautiful. Its simplicity focus on the truth and beauty of mathematics. What may seem like dry calculations and abstract formulas is often described by mathematicians as beautiful. With a blank page in my hand, at the 10th Triennial International Congress of Chinese Mathematicians, we ask the leading mathematicians to fill this page with the ideas they find most beautiful. Mathematical formula. formula? Yes, a formula. But this is one which defines a Kramian man for us. Right down here. It is very important in Langland's program. PSD Taishan. Yuan Xinyi is one of three gold medalists at this year's ICCM, the largest and most influential academic gathering in the Chinese mathematics community. In 2020, he gave up a tenured position at the University of California, Berkeley, and returned to China. Yuan has received an invitation to the International Congress of Mathematicians 2026 in Philadelphia, where he will deliver a 45-minute invited lecture. Yuan represents a new generation of Chinese mathematicians emerging on the global stage. So in the next 5 to 10 years, I think they will break through to become a leader in the mathematics community. The words come from Xin Tang Yao, a 76-year-old eminent mathematician of Chinese descent and president of the ICCM. Awarded the Fields Medal at 33, he became the first Chinese recipient of the honor. He has helped shape the transformation of mathematics in China over the decades. How do you assess the current standing of Chinese mathematics on the global stage? In the last five years alone, I think we have increased the output of research uh, in a rather dynamical manner and exciting, I would say. Many important work is now being done in China. And uh, although many of them come from outside, uh, mathematicians uh, who visit here, but still, I would say about one third of them are developed by mainland Chinese, two thirds come from outside. But I think by and large, I think it's very encouraged to see that gradually the local scholars are taking up the burden of developing, creating new directions. In the last five years, large scale of mathematician uh, come back and they helped to develop it. That would be the first incident to show the power of China as a powerhouse for mathematics. What motivated you to establish the Yao class? And what gap did you hope it would fill? I want to establish a very objective way to promote young students, young scholars, postdocs, to work on their own idea. Traditional education in China in the last 20 years, or even 30 years, depends on examinations. Uh, they have no intention to learn those truth and beauty behind mathematics and we need to change that. What does China still need to do in order for progress to continue in mathematics? They still depend a lot on looking at which journals it was published, the citation index and all this very artificial and machine uh, controlled way of judge, judgment of a scholar uh, which is not the best but I think it's changing and soon I think uh, there are more mathematicians who could have more freedom to think, to develop their own. So what drives these mathematicians to devote years, even decades, to a problem? To understand the meaning of mathematics, I turned to a Vietnamese-born mathematician. He is now chair of the Department of Mathematics at the University of Chicago. Mathematics is more about um, to create a language which uh, can explain in a comprehensive way, but the same very precise way of nature's. And why does mathematics still matter today? 
So somehow mathematics is the, the way to think um, beyond what people say the common sense, of, right? It's very much like art, like in, in the Chinese uh, wash ink art, very ab abstract. A very sim simple brush can capture the essence of the things. And mathematics is kind of essence, uh, essence of, of the world. At the start, I asked them to write their most beautiful formula. All came from the problems they dedicate so much time to solving. It's the pursuit of mathematics and of beauty itself. Mathematics was created 10,000 years ago, and so many people from around the world contribute to this beautiful garden, right? Mm. It is our duties you know, to preserve the beauties and maybe to put some stone or some plant to, to make it even more beautiful and mm. to, to give it back to the future generations.